are, 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 are an insult to troops. Uh, but uh, here is that report from the InfoWars Nightly News last night. In the wake of the tragic shooting at Fort Hood, Texas last week, Governor Rick Perry did what I expected him to do. He came out and ordered the flags in the state of Texas flown at half-mast, which on the surface seems like a nice thing to do. But it was Joseph Stalin, one of history's greatest tyrants, that said, when one man dies, it's a tragedy. When 10,000 die, it's a statistic. 22 veterans commit suicide every day, seven of them active duty. That's a world record, even breaking the record that we saw at the end of Vietnam. There's no discussion of that. They just throw more psychotropic drugs at them, known to cause suicide. They make them serve more and more deployments. They treat them like crap. A lot of them are going bankrupt. They cut their pay. They screw them over. But it's okay because Rick Perry put the flags at half mass, and then we all feel sorry for the dead. The three dead, four of you count the shooter, 16 wounded. When we've got 22 people killing themselves, seven every single day who are active duty. Think about that. The flag makes us feel good, like we're doing something for the veterans. It's sentimental. It's totally on the surface. Just like Obamacare. They say it's free. They say you can keep your doctor. You like your plan and your doctor, you can keep them. You'll be able to keep your health care plan. If you like your plan, you keep your plan. If you like your doctor, you like your plan, you can keep your doctor, you can keep your plan. They say it's wonderful. All of it's lies. Raises payroll taxes on poor people, gets rid of your doctor, doubles or triples prices, written by the big insurance companies, lets them lower the standard of care. Doesn't matter. Obama loves you and wanted to give you something. Like Perry gave us a flag at half-mast. And I'm not just attacking Rick Perry. He would be attacked if he didn't put the flag at half-mast. What does that say about us? We want to feel good about ourselves while not actually getting our hands dirty and finding out why the so-called volunteer army is killing itself. The truth is, too many deployments, drugs known to cause suicide, sweeping it under the rug, veterans being treated like crap, all these Homeland Security reports saying veterans are the number one terror threat in the future, that the Tea Party's a threat, that evangelicals are a threat. Simply put, the veterans are being treated like garbage, and that's why they're committing suicide. And so we need to stop treating them like garbage, not just pat them on the head or give the dog a bone by flying the flag at half-mast. It really is absurd, and it really illustrates how we've become a nation of BSers, run by a culture of PR pitchmen. In fact, they're getting rid of the White House press corps now. They're not even going to have regular press conferences. And why should they? They can just have PR flax, put out the lies, and then the accomplice media, the lapdog press, will go along with it. So that's why every time I saw the flags this last weekend at half mast, it irritated me because it reminded me of how not just the veterans, but foster children, anybody who's in government care or in government clutches is treated like absolute garbage. And how as the government and Obamacare and the school lunch program federalize everything, more and more, I am a slave of this system, just as you are, and I want off this plantation. I don't want to see our veterans treated like crap. I don't want to see the politicians exempt from all the things they do to us. I want to see them out there fighting for this empire if they think it's so great. But we know the rich kids of Congress almost never go to war. Alex Jones signing off for InfoWars Nightly News and InfoWars.com. Now back to InfoWars Nightly News. And again, folks, um, I will be hosting the Nightly News uh, at least three or four nights a week, most of it. And you'll have special reports and, 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 and guests. And, and we're ready to move into the new studio and turn it all on. I've just had a hundred other things going on, but that's getting very, very close. We couldn't have built all of this without you being PrisonPlanet.tv members. So we're going to take the info over to the next level. We're doing it right now. It's 15 cents a day or $5.95 a month, or you can get a year membership and get three months free, and you get 11 memberships for the price of one. Every membership can be used simultaneously by 11 people. You can share your username and passcode with friends and family. So share that, take advantage of that. Uh, the site just gets better and better. All my films, so much more. Become a PrisonPlanet.tv member today.
Uh, and we're moving away from PrisonPlanet.tv and the branding of it. I mean, I came up with that name years ago, along with InfoWars, because I wanted to fight the Prison Planet. It's going to be more and more just InfoWars news, but the URL will still be PrisonPlanet.tv, but we're going to have the URLs with InfoWars news in it, InfoWarsNews.com, you know, as the main focus, because we're going to, We've already got cable and TV already downloading it every day and putting it on cable and TV systems. We're just getting ready to put it up on satellite and deliver it a bunch of other places. I've had a lot of unforeseen, unexpected things going on that have really taken up a lot of my time. But we're uh, moving forward on that. So thank you all for your support. You can see it every night, 7 o'clock Central, PrisonPlanet.tv. Then those of you that are members, pay it forward. Large portions of it are then put on YouTube and other platforms for free to wake up the general unwashed, uninformed masses. So it's essential to fund the tip of the spear, buy your war bonds today. It's an incredible value. I want to thank all of you that are members, PrisonPlanet.tv. And don't forget, lastly, this hour was brought to you by MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex. It's organic, great customer service, great preparedness. MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex. Their phone number's on the site as well. Clean water at home, clean water at the office, clean water on the go. The Berkey Guy has a Berkey water filtration model for anywhere you are and one that fits any budget. Thousands of satisfied customers can't be wrong. For free shipping within the U.S., go to GoBerkey.com or call 877-886-3653. That's 877-886-3653. Helping thousands prepare since 2005, GoBerkey.com. Hi, this is Ted Anderson. Have you ever wondered why banks, stockbrokers, investment advisors won't talk about gold IRAs? They've been available since 1986, yet the financial industry won't recognize the value of gold for your retirement. Gold has outperformed paper investments, yet no word about IRAs. If you would like to have gold for your retirement, call 800-686-2237. Don't get left behind by rising inflation and low returns. Call 800-686-2237. Secure your future and call 1-800-686-2237. Big business has discovered the preparedness market, and that makes it difficult to know where to go and who to trust. MyPatriotSupply.com is owned and operated by patriots just like you. Has the best prices on storable food, non-GMO seeds, water filtration devices, home canning equipment, survival and self-reliance books, and more. MyPatriotSupply.com has old-fashioned values and the absolute best customer service in the industry. Look for the deal of the day, unique affordable survival supplies that fit anyone's budget. Get same-day shipping on all orders and free shipping on orders over $49. Call 866-229-0927. 866-229-0927. Or visit MyPatriotSupply.com for emergency preparedness, self-reliance, and food independence. Shop with a name you know and a name you can trust. Before it's time to survive, it's time to prepare. MyPatriotSupply.com. In the last 50 years, iodine has been phased out of our staple foods and replaced with the halogen bromine, a practice now banned in nations around the world. Guess what else is in the halogen family? Fluoride. Ladies and gentlemen, Alex Jones here. In 1924, the federal government did the right thing and encouraged salt producers to add iodine. It's the good halogen on the periodic table. And the results are on record, reports documented, a 15-point IQ increase in areas that had previously been deficient in iodine. Bottom line, iodine is important. Unbound, clean, in a glycerin base, nascent iodine was the answer for myself and my family. You will find Survival Shield nascent iodine exclusively at InfoWarsLife.com. InfoWars Life Survival Shield nascent iodine isn't just for emergencies. I take it every day. That's InfoWarsLife.com or call toll-free 888-253-3139. Sharpton, Agent C-17 for the FBI, his mission to sow racial discord and divides in New York City. Mission accomplished. You're a faithful servant of evil, Al Sharpton. You've been rewarded with a TV show on a collapsing television network. We're going to go back to your phone calls, and then I've got the Leanne McAdoo report uh, coming up in the next segment with uh, her going out 
and pointing out that big businesses are exempt from Obamacare, but mom and pops aren't, the ultimate form of discrimination. That's coming up. The video's up on Infowars.com. Right now, Michael in Texas, thanks for calling. You're on the air. How are you, Alex? Good, brother. My first time calling here. Uh, one thing I want to say, the guy with the IQ, I'm just now calming down on that guy. Uh, that guy was a joke. Uh, another thing here in East Texas, I tell these people, I've been listening to you for about a year, and uh, I try to spread the word what goes on, you know. It's got a... Uh, stuff I told them about, they don't have a clue. I mean, it's, uh, you know, the FEMA camp, when I saw the FEMA camp, that's the one thing that got my blood going, you know. Why well, of course, the they're they secretly spying on us without warrants. They're secretly narcotics trafficking. They're, they're engaging in criminal activity and saying it's national security. Well, it's not national security. It's national criminality run by offshore interest. And under the Emergency Centers Establishment Act, and under the Civilian Inmate Labor Camp Program in Rex 84, anybody can look this up, declassified, they have a secret archipelago of camps for us and our family. And these people mean business, and they're training Homeland Security as a national secret police force to stage terror attacks, blame it on us, and come after us. They want to do this, folks. People have to admit it. Go ahead. I tell them, you know, I mean, I have a lot of guns myself. I mean, whatever. But anyways, you know, a year ago when all the ammo went up, everybody's freaking out. Oh, it's just to boost the economy. It's just blah, blah, blah. They don't believe they bought 70 million rounds or whatever it was. That was one purchase. You it's know, like two, 2.6 billion last time I checked. Even mainline publications are saying, why is there a federal arms race? All these agencies that were never armed are arming. They're spending hundreds of millions per Social Security Administration on Blackwater-type mercenaries. Why don't people believe this? I mean, do they just watch CNN? Is that the problem? Well, the I mean, government can't believe the crimes it's gotten away with with the special interest. So they're digging in. I mean, they, they've already stolen trillions. I mean, I mean, they've taken over and they're now going to steal everything. And they've got a bunch of people that think they're do-gooders, you know, federal agents and people that are going to start the Civil War. And when the feds blow stuff up and blame it on us, the average fed's not going to know their bosses did it. But because of Fast and Furious in Oklahoma City and Benghazi, people now know about false flags. So it's not going to be a cakewalk this time. I mean, back to the just Obamacare. I mean, my girl graduated with a master's. She's uh, self-employed. She tried to get Obamacare. She can't afford normal insurance. And she's they wouldn't give it to them. But they'll go give it to someone sitting at home with five kids that doesn't work. Well, that's the yeah. goal, and because those people can vote, and then it's game over. Now, once they put the authoritarianism in, all these people sitting on their butts are going to be on TV in the work camps with people going, oh, look at those slobs. You know, they'll have Friday night movies and rock bands will come play for them. They advertise the camps in Germany and Russia as wonderful places. And in the Emergency Centers Establishment Act, it talks about community groups and music and, 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 you know, arts and crafts. It's just if you cause a problem, you're going to be taken to a special area. And, of course, you're going to have to be re-educated, mainly men, because we need to be here for the ego trip of socialists to beat us up before they rape our wives. This is GCN, the Genesis Communications Radio Network. This is Alex Jones for InfoWarsLife.com. The latest in preparedness is now here. An electrically stabilized colloidal silver solution that can be added to both your home cabinet and preparedness pack alike. Concentrated to 30 parts per million in what has been dubbed the Survival Silver Solution. The new InfoWars Life Silver Bullet Colloidal Silver is the answer for you and your family. And it's entirely free of toxic artificial additives that are loaded into many products. The InfoWars Life Silver Bullet Silver is so powerful that it is 
concentrated into a two ounce bottle and is not recommended for extended continual use. This is not a low grade formula. We are working with one of the top laboratory manufacturers in the United States to bring you the best form of colloidal silver using electrical processes within a base of deionized water for your preparedness storage or your home kitchen. Purchase your bottle of InfoWarsLife.com Silver Bullet Colloidal Silver today and find other amazing supplements at InfoWarsLife.com. 